Hi everyone, this is Carol. Welcome back to the official channel VidiProg Vlogger. New series of VidiProg Guide tutorial is now available in this channel, where you can find a complete set of videos showing you how to create stunning videos from scratch in VidiProg Vlogger. But before we dive into the journey, make sure you check out the link in the description box down below to download the software for free. Alright, so now, let's get the video started. Today we will walk you through a little tour about how to use constant speed change feature in VideoProc Vlogger to speed up your video. Speeding up a video is probably the most commonly used editing technique in video making, which you can find in like drone shot footage, travel, or daily vlog. It could make an otherwise boring clip more fun and interesting. As you create a new project, come to here, drag and drop the video to media library. Then, you drag the video down to the video track in the timeline. The first thing you need to do is to locate a clip you want to speed up. Select the target and split it out. Well, if you want to speed up the whole video, you could skip this part. Either way, you choose the footage you are going to work on. And here we are going to show you three ways to speed up the video. The first and also the easiest way is to use time stretch. Click the little triangle next to a ripple at the bottom. Now, in this little pull down menu, choose time stretch. Then, select a clip that lets to be sped up. Drag the end of the clip towards the middle to make it shorter. In this way, your video could be sped up instantly as fast as you want. 32 times, 64 times, or reach even higher. Alright, with this bottom right here, you could have your video accelerated with just one click in the timeline. See how easy is that? One thing you need to know is that if the video comes with the soundtrack, the audio would be sped up simultaneously as you speed up the video. If you want to keep the audio, click on mute video track and drag the original footage to audio track and crop it to the proper length until it fits in the edited clip. The second method that you could go with is go to the inspector and find play speed. And then choose a fixed parameter 2 times, 4 times, 8 times, or 16 times. Or click custom and move the slider to make adjustment of the mod pose as you like. Down here, you could input the duration of the clip you expect. VidiProc Vlogger will automatically match your acceleration speed to the time you adjust. The third way is to use a speed editor. Select the clip. Click on the long linear editor here in the play speed. Or click the speed in the toolbar to enter speed editor. And here you will find a bunch of presets. Click constant. In the pop-up row here, choose one that you want to leverage in your work. And in your left hand, you could scroll up the line to find more speed like 31 times, 32 times to embed in your editing. Besides, you can also select custom and manually adjust your Bezier curve to achieve a long linear speed change. Well, if you want to do something intense, create more dynamic and stylish speed ramping effects, you could go watching the tutorial over long linear speed change tutorial, and I will put a link in the top right corner of the screen. Well, a little tip here is that, by default, 
Speeding up a video won't affect the pitch of the audio if the video comes with a soundtrack. But if you want to do some to change the tones and the pitch, click the Change Voice Pitch button in the Speed Editor. Alright, now you've reached the end of today's video about how to speed up video in VideoProc Vlogger. I think you've got it. Anyway, don't forget to click the subscribe button to subscribe our channel if you haven't yet. We will see you soon in our next guide tutorial. Hope you enjoy. Bye bye.